stories of the day. The humid UAE summer is almost over. That is the humid summer on the LED we're talking about behind us. So unless you've been living in an air-conditioned filled rock, you'll have noticed that the last couple of months have been hot, uh, temperatures reaching 50 degrees in the UAE and humidity through the roof at 25, 75%. Well, we have some good news. According to Brahim Al Jarwan, chairman of board of directors of the Emirates Astronomy Society, said we are a month away from the rising of the star of Suhail. A month. One month. <laughs> So when we share this, we understand that maybe it's not the best news, but a month. But what does this mean? So the rising of the Suhail star signals the end of intense heat with the start of cooler weather, which will usually happen in late August. The exact date have, hasn't been specified just yet, but you might get that closer to the time. However, don't expect an immediate drop in, term, in temperatures after the star is seen. It's, it usually takes like 70 to 80 days. per uh, the cooler weather to be felt in the UAE. And let me tell you something, Casey. I, for the past two days, I would go, you know, like usually it would be very humid and I would tie my hair so I don't get humid, crazy hair. Mm-hmm. It hasn't been as humid. I, I feel like we had kind of, it was, as we said on Sunday, it was the hottest day in the world recorded across across the globe. Mm-hmm. And I feel like there was a little bit of a rise in temperatures, but it, it's kind of dipped down a little bit again. August tends to be a little bit more humid, I would say. Yeah. Um, and then I don't think we've seen the end of it just yet. I agree with you that there's been a dip, but I don't think it's the end. <laughs> um, but what we're saying is we're halfway through it, you know? I mean, look. Light at the end of the tunnel. That is true. There is, of course, there's always there's always a light at the, the end of the tunnel. The star is the light. Of course, of course, and we are waiting. I'm waiting, and that's why, like, it's like every morning when I go to the car, I'm like, oh yeah, it's still not that humid yet. It's getting better, and I even if it's like a bit of delusion. I think I feel so blessed because I drive to work, so I have a little bit of a walk outside, and then you're inside all day. So yeah, it's just the weekends. You just miss the. The walking, the hikes, I know, a lot. I really do. The Dubai winters are I just oh, so It's amazing. It's perfect. I even want to go to the beach, but I go like, you know what? I'm going to go to the beach during Dubai winter. But anyways, we love a Dubai winter, and so anyways. does the rest 